Hey everyone, I'm Nimrod Kaur, and I'm a solution architect at Bridge Group, the DevOps security platform for infrastructure engineers. I'm going to talk about an open source security tool, Chekhov, and the matching GitHub action that was contributed to it by Chris Mabrakis. First, a bit about Chekhov. Chekhov is an open source Python library that identifies misconfigurations in infrastructure as code frameworks such as Terraform, CloudFormation, and Kubernetes. Identifying these misconfigurations can be crucial to maintaining a secure baseline in the cloud due to the natural growth and scale that comes with working in the cloud. Chekhov comes pre-built with a library of over 100 best practice checks that are based on widely accepted cloud security frameworks for AWS, Microsoft Azure, and GCP. So how can you use Chekhov's GitHub action to leverage this great tool? Let's see a short demo. I'll share my screen. And what you see now is one of Bridge Crew's Terraform modules, and you can uh, take a closer look and see that it failed the latest build. Let's see what caused it to fail. Well, it's a check of GitHub action. Let's see why it failed. And you can see that there's one failed check. And if we'll look for it, we'll see that it found an S3 bucket set up. This is the actual Terraform uh, resource. And you'll see that it doesn't have MFA delete uh, flag enabled inside the versioning block, right? So how can we fix it? Since this is code, let's do it using pull request. So this is the pull request I opened to fix it. You can see the first commit did not fix the issue, but the second did, and all the change that uh, was added was to add the MFA delete flag. That's as simple as it gets. For we'll take a look at this build this time, GitHub check of, check of GitHub action, you'll see that their fail checks are now zero. How cool is that? Um, so if you would like to integrate check of GitHub action, it's really very simple. This is the entire YAML for the workflow that I added. You can see that uh, there are basically two steps. One checks out the repository, and the second is just to run the check of action on the repository. If you want to learn more about the uh, GitHub action, just go to uh, github.com slash marketplace slash actions, slash check out GitHub action. You'll have an example here of a YAML of how to configure it. And clicking on use latest version will give you the actual step with the updated version, so you don't need to look any further. Cool. Uh, other than that, Chekhov is, as I said, completely open source. You can find it in GitHub, Chekhov, and uh, we love contributions, so feel free to fork it add whatever you think is worthwhile and contribute it back. Um, there are guidelines here of how to get started, how to contribute. Feel free, it's really, really cool. Taking it one step further, you can connect to the Bridge Crew, you can connect the Bridge Crew GitHub app to your repository to scan your default branch. Using Bridge Crew's console, you can then easily find the specific lines that should be fixed in your current infrastructure as code and how. Let's see an example of that. So once you sign up for uh, Bridge Crew, which is completely free and it's not required a credit card, you'll be able to go to the uh, integrations tab and clicking on GitHub as you see here. Obviously for a new uh, account, this page will be empty, but what you can do is click authorize. You will be redirected to the GitHub marketplace where you'll uh, authorize our app and select the repository that you allow it to scan. And you, when you click confirm, you'll be redirected to uh, this page and it will be open like this, where you can uh, select the repositories you want to integrate with our uh, console. Once you select it, we will scan uh, your uh, repository for you, and, and the findings will be found in the incident tab. Let's take a look at it. So uh, this is an example uh, incident that we found, uh, EBS snapshot that does not have encryption. And when you click on the resource, you'll see the exact repository that it's in, the, uh, the path and the exact file from the repository root, and what should be fixed. It's, it's really, it doesn't get any simpler than that. So uh, thank you for your time, and I hope you, you enjoyed this talk. Bye-bye.